Our verses for today come from Acts chapter 16, verses 9 and 10. And this comes from the book of Acts where Paul and his ministry team, if you will, are praying about what is the Holy Spirit calling them to do in their lives? What are they supposed to do next? And it says, during the night, Paul had a vision. There stood a man of Macedonia pleading with him and saying, come over to Macedonia and help us. When he had seen the vision, we immediately tried to cross over to Macedonia, being convinced that God had called us to proclaim the good news to them. One of the fascinating things we see throughout the book of Acts is how much the early church was led by the Holy Spirit into whatever they were called to do next. And often the Holy Spirit took people to places and to people that surprised them and also didn't lead them to other people and other places, which was often surprising. The context for today's verses in Acts chapter 16 is that as they tried to discern where they were going to go, they were blocked. That was their perception from going in one direction. And so they didn't rush forward. They were praying and trying to discern what they were supposed to do until Paul has this vision. And once Paul has the vision, you notice how they respond immediately. And in some ways, this is what we're called to do in life as well. Uh, you know, we're switching from two services to three services, and we're pivoting very quickly. But part of that is because we're seeing things change. And so when you see change, you need to move. But it's also important from a missions standpoint to understand we want to go where help is needed, where help is requested, and that means going beyond our own borders. Paul and his early ministry team understood that God was calling them not just to Jerusalem, or not even just to Judea and Samaria, but to the ends of the earth and to people of different countries and different cultures. And here we are 2,000 years later, recognizing that we have a similar call. Many of us are prompted by the needs in our own country and in our own part of New England here on Cape Cod, but there are needs all over the world and we are called to try to alleviate suffering, to try to bring the good news where we can, locally, regionally and nationally, and internationally. And we see that from Paul and his team. Who might be calling you to come over and help them? Have your ears and your heart open to the Spirit. Who knows where God may be calling you?